welcome to Tales of Honor Podcast, a podcast dedicated to telling the true stories of every recipient of the Medal of Honor. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Tales of Honor Podcast. I'm your host, Christoph Ambrose, and today's episode is episode number 295. Before we get into today's story, I have two little bits I want to go over here. Number one is, please keep Medal of Honor recipient Benny Atkins in your uh, in your thoughts and prayers. Recently, he was hospitalized due to the COVID-19 outbreak, and uh, we are wishing him a speedy recovery. Also, if you missed sending in your letter to Medal of Honor mail call, uh, it has now been extended, and it's been extended virtually as well. So you can go on to janinestange.com slash M-O-H, and the instructions are on there. You can actually send your Medal of Honor recipient a note uh, virtually. There's a little uh, submission form there. You can put your name, email, and a drop-down menu for which recipient you would like to send a message to, and there is a comment section there so you can write out what you'd like to say. Uh, you can upload a photo or a drawing as well. Uh, so there's an, there's an attachment section and uh, you can go ahead and send that out. There is also a return address section there that is optional. So if you'd like to maybe receive something back, you can also put your information there. So if you missed it, go ahead and uh, go to janinestage.com slash M-O-H. I will have the link in the show notes. I know a lot of people have some extra time on their hands right now, so this might be a good thing to do with yourself and with your kids to help them learn a little bit about these Medal of Honor recipients and reach out to them with a message of thanks for all that they have done. That's all I got for this week. Let's move on with episode 295 from World War I. And now, a tale of honor. James was born as Jaco Mestrovic in the Bay of Kotor, Austrian littoral, which is now Montenegro, on the 22nd of May, 1894, and he emigrated to the United States in 1913. He moved from Fresno, California to Pennsylvania, where he enlisted in the U.S. Army in Pittsburgh with the 28th Infantry Division. James was a sergeant with Company C, 111th Infantry, when he was deployed to France, and it was his actions on the 10th of August, 1918, that earned him the Medal of Honor. The citation reads, Seeing his company commander lying wounded 30 yards in front of the line after his company had withdrawn to a sheltered position behind a stone wall, Sergeant Mestrovich voluntarily left cover and crawled through heavy machine gun and shell fire to where the officer lay. He took the officer upon his back and crawled to a place of safety where he administered first aid treatment, his exceptional heroism saving the officer's life. James continued to fight and served after these actions, but contracted the Spanish flu, which took his life one week before the end of the war on the 4th of November, 1918. He posthumously received the Medal of Honor on the 31st of December, 1919, and James I. Mestrovich, is buried in the Sveti Jovan churchyard in Kotor, Montenegro. And that was a Tale of Honor. Thank you for listening to Tales of Honor Podcast. Head on over to talesofhonorpodcast.com where you can read these stories, see other ways to support the show, and easily share a story with your friends and family. Tales of Honor Podcast is written and produced by Christoph Ambrosch, and theme song, A New Beginning, is by Ben Sound. If you have any questions or comments, you can send them to Tales of Honor Podcast at gmail.com. And until next time, I'm Christoph Ambrose. Thanks for listening. Mm-hmm.